Welcome back from Graphic Extras. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how to combine multiple gradients uh, to create some um, unusual color effects. And I'm using blending modes. And I've been in previous videos, I've shown how to use layers and blending modes, but this time I'm just going to use the gradient tool and blending modes. And now you could use any blending mode. I'm over here in Photoshop. I've actually got a difference, but I, you could use, of course, any of the other options. There's loads of them. Darken, lighten, etc. I've got a standard gradient here. This is one of the gradients that come with Photoshop. So, of course, you could use with other gradients. There's many gradients available on the web. Of course, you can make your own gradient. I'm just going to go to the gradient tool. I'm going to apply it in ellipse. I'm just going to just drag across from the center point to the length of the gradient. And I'm now just going to apply another direction. And immediately, you've got a an unusual color effect. So I'm just go across again. And you, you know, at this point you could stop, you could use that as a maybe a background, overlay, maybe a source for brushes, whatever, patterns, many more. But you can of course also apply effects, like I say, you just go adjustments, black and white. Tweak that a bit. It's another way, of course, and you can continue on from this point. Now you now you just go and say maybe select another gradient. I can just apply that. And at that point, I think I'll be finishing. But uh, that's the general idea. Just use blending modes and the gradient tool. And you can create virtually unlimited type of color effects for use throughout Photoshop. And obviously you can uh, combine them with maybe text and other elements like shapes or whatever. Anyway, I hope you found this quick tutorial of interest and that you'll subscribe to the Graphic Extras channel. I'll add in new tutorials over the next couple of days, so uh, thank you very much.